Hello everyone and once again I welcome you all to my channel Technotube and you are in the series of Fundamentals of Cyber Security. In the previous session you had seen uh, the fin scan, okay. We are actually seeing the port scanning, the whole end map, right. Uh, and in this session we are going to see the next scan, uh, we will see null scan, okay. So let us understand null scan. So what do you mean by null scan? You see, your null scan here. Your null scan is basically is is a kind of packet which doesn't have anything. Okay, it's a sequence of zeros. So it holds sequence of a zero inside the inside the null packet. Okay, so it is the thing. And how can you do that in the nmap? It's a simple syntax. You write nmap and then dash and then you simply write capital N for null scan dash p21 and 192.168.117.134 this is the syntax of null scan so this capital N says that it is a null scan so you see in this null scan there is no flag okay as it is completely empty okay it's an empty packet so there is no flag associated with it there is no flag I'm sorry um, <laughs> associated with this scan okay so if there is no flag associated with this scan then how can i know that this is a null scan well it's somehow very it somehow it depends on the ana analysis and we will see in the bar chart it's a later thing but there is no flag associated with this scan right so when this packet so let me open up paint here and uh, explain you so here so let's say this is a packet of uh, this is a packet of null and you see this null, null packet is having series of zeros, okay. It is a null packet, empty packet. There is no flag inside. There is no flag, okay. So flag, what do you mean by flag? Flag is nothing but like sin, like ACK, uh, there is a RST, uh, there is fin and, and so on. There is no flag at all. So this packet is moving to the, to the destination, right. This is moving to the destination. So when it reaches to the target system, when it reaches to the target system, so target if target has an enabled firewall, then it will only tell you that yeah, the port 21 is open and filtered, right? Because there is a firewall avail available, available to it. But when it sees that this is a null packet, it simply what it simply does, it will you know just discard the packet. It will discard the null packet and it will not reply to the uh, to the attacker it will not reply however it will tell you that you know that port is open or filtered but it will not reply back to the uh, this uh, attacker why because null is a simply uh, simply an empty packet there is no e there is no request at all okay it is not requesting anything it is not uh, want any kind of service there it just sending a null sequence of zeros to the target system just to check that port 21 is responding me responding back or not okay can i can i know the status of port 21 so if the target is alive then it will you know tell you that port port 21 is open or filtered so let's see this here in the uh, in the command prompt here <clears throat> so nmap dash s uh, capital n dash p21 192.168 i'm sorry uh 117.134 this is a scan and you will see that uh, my extreme machine is ready here and uh, within a few seconds, you will see that port 21 is filtered or open, okay. As my firewall is enabled in the XP machine, definitely it is going to be a filtered uh, port 21. Uh, let's see. You can see here, open filtered. Now, let me uh, close my, you know, firewall. Let me see this. What kind of result I am getting here. So, control panel and security center. Uh, you know, the firewall is open here. Let me just uh, close the firewall. Let's see the, the result here. So, when the firewall is uh, closed, let me one more time I'd run it. Let's see. And uh, yeah, you see here that <laughs> you see as my firewall is closed, I mean it is disabled, it says that port 21 is closed. And why port 21 is closed? is because it is a null scan null scan as i told you that that it is not 
replying you back at the attacker okay it will not reply the connection is going to be discarded okay now i can see that it says me that is a closed port it means that you know my host is alive and still it is closed uh, still it is closed but if you see the tcp scan it is open right it is just matter of fact that it is a null scan and null scan always gives you a closed connection okay but however if you open the firewall it will tell you that it is open and it is filtered right so this is the basic difference between the fin scan and the uh, the null scan and the uh, you know it is the difference between the firewall open and close so uh, when your firewall is on uh, this packet is going to be observed by the firewall uh, this packet is going to be op observed by the firewall definitely the null packet is going to be discarded but the you know respond firewall will respond back to the attacker that this port is filtered by me okay it is being filtered by me attacker will understand that yes maybe this port is open but it is filtered somehow right however if you close the firewall if you disable the firewall <coughs> then this null packet is directly going to be dropped by the target saying that uh, you know i'm not listening on this port okay uh, because as you are not requesting anything you are uh, null packet is having sequence of zeros only okay what should i reply you back right so it just simply discarded but you can see the state of 21 port here after the disabling of uh, sorry enabling the sorry disabling the firewall it says 21 port is closed uh, however uh, 21 port is open when my firewall is uh, you see <coughs> firewall is uh, uh, enabled right so this is the basic difference between firewall on and firewall uh, off uh, with the null scan right now we want to see that how this null scan can be found in the wireshark sir how, how how do i know it well it's a simple thing when you want to see in your wireshark logs that where exactly this null scan you need to check out the none okay n o n e let's see this in the wireshark so when i run when i start this uh, you know this whole thing continue without saving and one more time i'm gonna run this uh, so let me first clear this whole thing and let me take a fresh start here and do that now uh, let's wait for some time just uh, i want a result here uh, see the result take some yeah so now when i get the result here you see i stop this connection when i stop this connection you see here 130 is my kali machine and 134 is my xp machine what it what it gives me it says it says that it is a none here so with the help of none what you can see that it is a null scan so if you are a network administrator then you can find this null scan with the help of this if you can see this null okay so here in the uh, um, ipv4 packet and uh, it's a total length is 40 right. so it's a right right and let me see that uh, what other things are there other things are in the tcp it's a tcp uh, path uh, TCP segment length is zero. Yeah. So, yeah. so the destination port is twenty one. So it is right. But you can see that this is a a null packet. I mean, it is a null packet which says that is it's a sequence of zeros. So one zero zero zero. There is nothing in the in the packet. Okay. So uh, you can see this is an example. And after that, uh, your uh, one thirty four. You know, one thirty four is basically. Uh, my xp machine uh, it say it sends you the reset packet with an acknowledgement uh, why it says is because i just had enabled the uh, sorry disable the firewall that's why it is uh, you know replying you back with something i i mean it is saying that the packet is null right so you need to uh, terminate this connection and you need to restart it so rst means a reset the connection so please reset the connection and send something uh, valuable so as I'm sending a null packet which is not valuable, my XP machine is saying to the Kali machine that send some valuable thing, reset your connection. Okay, so this is the this is the that thing. I hope uh, you understand a null scan, and we will see you in the next session with uh, another scan. Okay, so if you like this video, then please hit hit that like button. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe to it. Okay, thank you so much for this. If you have any doubt, you can ask me in the comment uh, comment section, and I would be happy to help you. Thank you so much, guys.